Hi there, my name's Jeff. This is our big LVD guillotine, two and a half metres by four millimetre mild steel, three phase. It's got a, um, a conveyor belt system for removing um, your sheets out the back and also a um, separate wee flap which um, is on the remote control here for um, bypassing your wee slithers into a scrap box um, underneath the conveyor. Um, it's a complete locking machine. I'm just coming out of a working situation. Um, it looks really good. I've removed the um, supports here for the video, um, but you'll see them on the photos themselves. So yeah, general condition of it's pretty good. Okay, we'll power it up. It's a hydraulic pump running there. Um, it's got uh, the blade gap adjuster, um, just a manual adjuster, and also the electrical in and out on the back gauge, which is working fine, sounds smooth. And also the wee inching function on that back gauge. Other functions that it's got is the angle of the blade itself. Um, from 0.5 to 2 degrees. That's adjusted that angle there. Adjusted it again and then now letting it back to the where it was, which you can let it back to any angle you choose. That's working good. Um, picture here looks as though it's got a, um, a light on it. Um, I can't see it at the moment but I assume that's what that is. Um, the remote cutting function. It's got two functions. Um, it's got the one function which is what it's on now, which is you touch your um, foot pedal remote and then you can take your foot straight off and it'll go through a complete cutting cycle. That's it there. And the other function you can switch it to and basically you um, keep your foot on the remote pedal and if you choose to take it off at any stage it stops the cut. That's working. Um, the other function is that it's got is um, how far the guillotine goes through um, its full cut. Um, for instance, at the moment it's set on full cut, and there's a wee varying electrical um, dial here, so you can have it to do half a cut or quarter of a cut. So that's on three quarters. That's half. And that's just a quarter cut. Um, so that's variable and that's working good. That's pretty much um, all the functions on the dis uh, display board with the control panel here. It's got the wee counter, um, etc. So yeah, remote's working good. Now the other function that the remote has is uh, the left pedal. I'll move that over there, um, operates um, uh, the uh, conveyor um, scrap bypass flap um, which I'll quickly move the um, camera around and show you but um, that's the guillotine, um, the hydraulics seem good the um, look of the wee um, nylon clamping setups there um, all look good and clean and seems to be operating well Ok I'll quickly move the camera around the, so you can see the conveyor, I haven't figured out to, how to use the paws on this yet, and I'll show you the conveyor itself and um, its functions, there, so basically with the conveyor, um, There it is running there, um, and that's the wee scrap bypass flap, it's up so then um, your um, sheet's coming along, hit that and go down into the catch tray for the scrap, that's down, I'll turn this off, and um, so it's variable electrical control so that's slowing it down get it very slow and then speed it right up. So the variable control is working there. 
And the other function that it has is, I've just switched it on, um, this wee shuffle set up here, um, so I assume you'd have like a forklift pallet uh, with your um, sheets on there positioned if you were doing big runs, and that's just a pneumatic ram there um, to align them. Turn that off. Um, I also noticed at one stage, I'm not exactly sure how it works, um, but at one stage um, when I had my foot on um, the pedal it would do a couple of shuffles automatically and it's got a couple of adjustable timers in there but um, I'm sure the new owner will be able to um, work that all out. So yeah, it's nice and quiet, uh, the belts are in good condition, I'll just stop that. Um, obviously you'll need air to it um, for those couple of functions to be working um, if you chose to use those functions. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, the whole thing looks good. Uh, the actual guillotine itself and the conveyor system um, is all looking really, really good and it's got some good features.